Hello ladies! Welcome back to another fall outfits video. But in this video, I'm actually sharing some really comfy but yet chic fall outfit ideas that you can actually wear at home and you can also wear outside. I have taken three essential pieces that I absolutely live in. A slouchy jeans, a pleated skirt and a knit dress that I find like are the most comfortable pieces in my closet and I absolutely wear and I've styled all of my outfits, all these 16 outfits around it. So let's get started. The first essential piece that I'm wearing is the slouchy jeans from Mango. I have literally li lived in these jeans for more than a year and I can absolutely say that they are really comfortable to wear around the house. I wear it all day when I'm working at home. I paired it with a crop top from H&M and a matching lavender cardigan. I find that these two pieces were something that I really gravitated when I was looking at the H&M site. They have really, really comfy and really colorful styles. And I find that lavender color is such an in color for this season. And this cardigan was like under $40, guys. So absolutely going to be wearing this a lot. Now, if I want to step out in this outfit, all I did is I buttoned the cardigan and I swapped my loafers with booties and I just layered in another plaid coat. I just find a plaid coat adds a lot of dimension and texture to this otherwise really solid outfit and it makes the outfit dressy as well. This year is the cardigan year and why not? We all are at home and cardigans are an excellent way of layering. So I bought this one which has these B buttons which are so cute from End of the Stories. They have so many other colors and I kept going back to their store for, to look at all these cardigans so I had to have this one. This is a more cropped style so it looks really chic as an all black look with the black slouchy jeans. I just paired it with a neutral loafer mules. You can wear flip flops slippers around the house um, but I find that this looks really structured and because it's a cropped style it looks really really chic. Well, this outfit is actually perfect even when you're going outside it's comfortable it's cozy and it's chic. I just added a colored coat because this is an all black look and I swapped my loafers with some stiletto sandals and I really think this is so chic for a night out. But who's going out by the way? I find that slouchy jeans are an excellent way of adding some bohemian touch to your look. So for this outfit, I added a bohemian cotton tissue puff sleeve top from Free People. Um, it has got black print and is almost like a burgundy magenta color tone, which I absolutely love. Colors are my favorite. And I paired it with this cropped knit vest from Free People as well. This is giving me such a chic vibe and I added this belt and oh my god this outfit is something that I absolutely will be wearing when I'm working from home all day. If I wanted to step out in this outfit I would just take out the vest and add a black coat making it more of a structured style and swap my loafers with some pumps adding nude pumps kind of adds a different dimension to this black outfit and this outfit is so chic for even going to work or even for going out as well Skirts are extremely comfortable to wear around the house. We all know that. So I paired this um, kind of satiny tone burnt orange pleated skirt from Club Monaco. I paired it with just a black knit top. The top is from Express and it is back this year as well. You can totally wear this just like that but I paired in a plaid blazer to add some dimension and some more um, chicness to this outfit. For 
for going out in this outfit I just belted the blazer which is my favorite way of making a blazer look even more chic and stylish and and perfect for going out and I swapped my loafers with some nude pumps you can also use booties but I find that pumps in general make an outfit look dressier With this next look with the pleated skirt, I added a striped full sleeve tee. I find that striped tees are as basic as just solid color tees. They go well with a lot of other pieces. So I had to pair it and it looks really awesome. And I added a long cardigan. This outfit is giving me all the comfy and chic vibe that I was going for. For my going out version of this outfit, all I did is I swapped the long cardigan with the leather jacket and I swapped my loafers with some heeled booties and that's it guys. This outfit looks perfect for a night out or even running errands which we are doing mostly these days. This knit t-shirt dress from Free People is something that I will be living in, literally. I bought two different colors. Um, this black color is one of the most basic ways of wearing this dress around the house. I sized up. I'm usually size small but I sized up because it is more of a fitted silhouette and I want to be a little bit comfortable around the house. Uh, plus there's many ways you can layer this up. So for the first look I just added my lilac or lavender cardigan with this outfit and I find that that is this is my, like a go-to outfit that you can throw in when you're in a hurry to go somewhere or even when you're in a hurry for a meeting at home. <music> For going out with the same outfit, all I did is I buttoned the cardigan, leaving the last button, and I belted the cardigan, giving it more of a waistline and a structure versus because this cardigan is a little bit oversized. And I swapped my loafers with some um, booties. Now these booties I've had from Steve Madden since last year. They are giving me all the combat boot style. If you have combat boots, you can actually swap them with those as well. Literally ladies, I featured this outfit on my Instagram and you guys loved it so I had to share it here as well. For this next look with this knit dress, I added a cropped sweater. Now this is again a go-to way of wearing a knit dress around the house when it gets a little cooler. It is not that cold right now here in California. It's still kind of warm, but when it does get cooler, this is how I would love to wear this t-shirt dress. And to head out with the same outfit, all I did was add a plaid coat, again adding more dimension and texture to this outfit. And I added a white lace booties. Oh my god, I'm obsessed with lace booties and these ones I bought from Sky, I believe, last year. But I will find some similar pieces if I could and link them in the description box. Now, I had to also pair this t-shirt dress with a long cardigan because long cardigan is again a such a versatile piece and it's really comfy to wear when you're at home uh, lounging or sitting and working. So I paired it with this leopard print um, which is an absolute contrast to this black solid dress and it actually adds a little bit more of color to this outfit um, but I find that you can also use a solid color uh, long cardigan as well and it will still look awesome and to head out what I did is I rather than wearing booties I actually swapped it with a tall boots because this dress is long enough it gives an appearance of a booty versus a tall boot and this is also a great way if you're stepping out and it's cooler and you want a little bit more warmth because this dress is lightweight a tall boot will give you a little bit more warmth and i belted the long cardigan which is an awesome way of actually making this cardigan look way more chic I hope you guys found some outfit inspiration from today's video. I would love to know which one was your favorite outfit and outfits that you would absolutely wear at home.
If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to click that like button and hit that subscribe button and the bell icon for any kind of notification for more outfit ideas videos. Thank you so much for watching this video and I will see you in my next video. Bye!